Give me, 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 give What the deal? What the deal? What the deal? Jamaican this jack is ZJ Wawa has been charged by federal authorities in the United States in relation to a lottery scam investigation in which he is alleged to be a part of a group scamming elderly residents in North Dakota and elsewhere. ZJ Wawa has been charged with conspiracy to commit mail and wire fraud as well as money laundering. Each of the counts carry a maximum prison term of 30 years. It is alleged that they, the police, have been watching him for about two years. Wawa was given a trial date of September 15th. Joint investigation that we carried out with our international counterparts for the past two and a half years, which led to the arrest of Dionville O'Hara. <clears throat> OC, DJ Wawa, and 25 other persons. Of the 26 individuals indicted, 16 of these persons are Jamaicans, 10 of whom were arrested in 2012 by the Lottery Scam Task Force. And Detective Corporal Watson put an end to speculation about the reasons behind popular local disc jockey ZJ Wawa being detained in the United States. O'Hara O.C. D.J. Wawa, who was returning to Jamaica, to Jamaica from the United States in November of 2012, was intercepted by the Custom Enforcement Team at the Sangsters International Airport. And he was found with 105,000 United States dollars in his possession, which is allegedly um, proceeds of a lottery scam. What the deal? DJ Khaled wants Bounty Killer and his protege Movado to make peace by making a song together as an indication that they have set aside their differences. Will it happen? Who knows? Look into my eyes, tell me what you see. Can you feel my pain? Am I your enemy? You know so bad the way. Things will be your man. You're your friend or no? This is your land. Listen to my voice. This is not a trend. No, you say the... What the deal? Spice has gotten back together with her boyfriend with whom she shares two children with. The DJ who a few months ago called it quits tells Music News that they have ironed out the issues. We're back together. <laughs> As everybody know, people, man and woman, you know, you're going to have your differences. We have two kids together, and so it's just natural that to communicate and have to, you know. You know, man and woman single, we're going to have our differences, our regular, um, you know. But we have two kids, we're moving on as a family. We have to talk because of the kids, because we're responsible parents. So, as anybody will know, we have to communicate. And, you know, one thing leads to another, that's something there, and that's something there. And, and so we're just back together now. <laughs> What the deal? After years of legal battles which resulted in the loss of his travel documents, Ninja Man the dancehall veteran had his passport returned recently and is now free to travel with permission from the court. I feel good when you're wrapped up in my arms Dancing to a reggae song Feel good, feel good I feel good Cause your perfume isn't loud and only I can talk about Feel good, feel good What the deal? Idonia's camp is responding following heavy criticism on social media blasting the DJ for wearing a skirt. According to the DJ's publicist, Idonia did not wear a skirt, describing the skirt-like clothing as a long merina. First of all, what you're seeing on Twitter is not a skirt. For the people who know fashion sense, you'll see that I don't know wore a blazer with a long marina, leather marina underneath it, and a blue pants. That's what you're seeing on Twitter. Is somebody creating some form of mischief? I don't know if people want to go into some place with a high, because actually, 
you wore that outfit last year at Sumpress. So if you go on Sumpress page, you'll see, if you go on my Twitter page at First KTR, you'll see that outfit that you wore from last year. So I don't know why somebody's going to rehash something that was worn last year. So I don't I really understand. People who don't have any fashion sense, they're going to want to say otherwise. What the deal? There's been much speculation about who will close Jamaica's biggest summer music festival. According to the promoter, Mr. Johnny Guzong, Ayakten will be closing the show. Upon last week, Ayakten stated that he will not be closing the show this year, passing on the baton to Mr. Vegas, who much criticized his performance on social media after he closed the show last year. Ayakten will be closing dance all night. Absolutely, definitely will be closing dance all night. But everybody needs to come to the dance all night to see for themselves. You know, he did a great job last year and, you know, he's planning to do an even better one this year, you know. He's an electrifying performer and, you know, we know what to expect of him. There are several other uh, dance hall performers who are just who are perhaps capable of doing it. But I ask him, is the person that will be doing it and he's more than capable. What the deal? A photograph circulating on the internet shows a young man with his face buried in Makadaman's chest is now a new controversy. It is not certain if the picture, which is rated R, is part of Makadaman's promotional campaign following the video shoot of her single, Karma, in Long Island, New York. You can keep me warm in a hub, no doubt. Na, 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 na. So baby, come fuck me out. What the deal? People, make sure you check out the islandvice.com for the latest music news and mixtape. It is very easy to sign up, so come and join the community. What the deal? What the deal? What the deal? Bitch and this, we're specialists Of your two nipple, them and I'm gonna and them a turn and twist Come on! swing from a thing like this Y'all you know Bitch and this, grind the color this I examine and I give a proper mix diagnosis In a me private practice Y'all you know Titi fit, pussy no sick Baby you never get, get suck in a dick You no get body wash, not a dirty a dick